Hey guys, Luke here, coming back for a reaction to GOT7's new music video, A, and I'm actually looking forward to this one. I only watched their debut music video today for the first time, unfortunately, but I spent a little time trying to get to know their faces and their names, so hopefully my experience will be a little more enriched. I think I'm actually going to like this song a little better than their first one, because this one sounds a bit more like up my alley. <laughs> yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna watch the new music video. <clears throat> okay, so they're going into some cafe diner place. <laughs> they all spotted the one girl. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that happening in real life. You know, sometimes I'm kind of happy I'm not a girl because I don't want to be creepily stared at by a group of guys. I guess it's not that creepy, but... Definitely like this beat. I feel like I'm not reacting enough because I'm just reading the lyrics, but this is a really impressive set so far. The colors are really popping and yeah. I actually think she's really attractive too. But <laughs> I don't like how all seven of them are going for the same one, but <laughs> whatever. I mean, oh, there's other ones right there, you know? I definitely like that beginning of the chorus, like, hey. I thought I wouldn't like it, but it sounds good. <laughs> Product placement, maybe? <laughs> That's cool that they have foreigners in this music video. Okay, I'm gonna try to remember their names. Is that Jackson? That's Bam Bam, right? They're really like well polished and good group though, like I wasn't really feeling it with their first song, but I I like this. I feel like this could be a really good comeback for them. Not that the first was bad, it's just, I feel like they brought it to another level with this. <laughs> it reminds me a lot of like a 90s music video in the car, you know, just like S Club 7 style. <laughs> I might actually look into what the choreography is like for this one, because I keep wanting to learn a choreography, oh, okay, I can't do that stuff, but <laughs> they can, obviously they are superior. I feel like that went by too fast. <laughs> She's slacking on the job, yo, I think. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually cool. I mean, I learned today that GOT7 is a pretty, like, internationally formed group, right? Like, someone from Thailand, someone from Hong Kong, other places too, but that's cool. They all look really talented and they're pretty good looking too. Nothing to complain about. I really liked the styling and the choreography and the song, and it surprised me. Yeah, I mean, I watched... I actually did not watch any of their comeback performances on music shows yet because I just wanted to have a really first genuine reaction to the music video and I'm glad I did that. And if someone can tell me which members speak English, because I know Jackson does, I don't know if anyone else does, but they all seem to have a lot of English names anyway, so I'm really curious about that. And I think that's everything I have to say for now, but please let me know what you guys thought of the music video in the comments down below 
and I will be back next time. Also, not related to this video, but I would just like to note that I am thinking about going to KCON 2014 in LA this year, and if you have been to KCON, I would really like to know your insight on whether or not you think it's good to go in alone, especially because I'm flying like 2,000 miles or kilometers, whatever you want to call it. So I really want to know if you think it's worth me going to KCON, even if you haven't been, if you'd like me to go and vlog and do stuff for you there, please let me know, because it'll make my decision a lot easier. I've only got like five days left to decide, so chop chop. <laughs> See you guys next time.